welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a fall haul. And I don't remember the last time I did a haul like this. Not a school supplies haul, but an actual haul. And I think it was my pre-summer haul. So here we go. This is sort of a collective haul with clothing and whatnot. So let's just begin. I hope you guys enjoy and don't think that I'm bragging because I just love watching haul videos. And I hope you guys do too. But if you don't, you don't have to watch. Anyways, let's just get started so here is what i got and this is not all in one trip this is split up throughout like the month and even a little bit before but yes here we go so at brandy Marvel, the first thing that i'll show you is um a sweater and this is one of their very thin sweaters it's a hoodie that is also zip up and this is not a try on haul i'm really sorry if next time you want me to do a try on haul just let me know and i just think this is really good just because it's so simple and really soft so that's the signature kind of brandy melville soft material so yeah the next thing that i picked up um is this blue t-shirt that says california in this really cute font um but this was like twenty dollars and it's just a very nice slightly cropped t-shirt uh, super simple, very soft, and goes with a lot of things. That's the kind of that's what I think about when I'm choosing things to buy. Will it will it go with these jeans? Will it go with these leggings? Will it go with these pants? Will it go with this? Will it go with that? Do I only can I only wear it in the winter? Can I only wear it in the summer? Those kind of things. And I like to just think about that when I'm buying something, just so that I can wear it with everything and I don't waste it. <laughs> but yeah. next thing I picked up is this sweater. And it's that really cute um, little alien patch that they have. And it's a really nice cropped gray sweater, as you can see. Very big and oversized, but at the same time it's fitting. So I'm not really sure how to explain it. It's got these cute sleeves. Everything is cute, very comfy, and perfect for fall and winter. The inside is so soft. It's fleece, I'm pretty sure. So it's very warm and thick and comfy and good for winter and fall so that's kind of what I'm keeping in mind and next thing is this t-shirt and I do love this t-shirt so much because Brandy Melville sells a lot of striped clothing so I just love this because it's got the stripes which I love but so many different colors and just a different kind of pattern going on kind of a thicker stripe or a color block with there and then just more colors which I just love so much and of course super soft goes with anything that's all I'm thinking about at the moment and very beautiful next thing from Brandy Melville is a t-shirt again but this is just one of their simple sheer v-neck t-shirts slightly cropped not too much a nice v-neck and I just love this it was pretty expensive for a v-neck but at the same time it's Brandy Melville and it's so soft and it's the beautiful fit the beautiful way that they make it and it's just such a nice it. I just can't handle it and because it's a v-neck I think it'd look really cute with just like a lace bralette and oh god so wonderful and so soft oh. uh, the next thing I got is this ribbed quarter length sleeve top it's got a really nice neckline I'm not really sure you explain that but I wore this in my last um, video if you noticed but I just love the stripes on it and just the black and white and the how it's ribbed it's so stretchy yet it's so tight fitting like not tight suffocating but tight perfect fitting so that's why I just love it next and the next and last thing that I got is this sweater um, it's a long sleeve slightly cropped um, really nice soft sweater as you can see it's not super thick but it's still warm and soft I really do love this just because it can go with a lot of things and it works perfectly for the fall and it's got a, such a cute just neckline and I do love this a lot and it's just Brandy Melville man I never go in there without finding something you know that's just why it's my favorite so store the next place I went to was Forever 21 and I got one thing from there um but I got this cropped sweater, kind of like the Brandy Melville ones, but it's just not as like soft, but it's still very cute. This is the Barbie sweater. It's really adorable, and I always see the Wild Fox sweaters with the Barbie logos and stuff like that, so I found this, and I just thought it was so adorable. The next store that I went to was Topshop, and I 
really do love Topshop. The style of it is just very nice, such good quality, and really sophisticated but still edgy clothing. I found a really nice pair of jeans at Topshop, which is this pair of black jeans, and they're pretty expensive, but honestly, just because it's really hard for me to find the perfect high-waisted skinny jeans just because I'm such a small person that it's hard to find perfect fitting jeans um, but Topshop is my place now to go for jeans because of the perfect fit like okay so here's what I got I got this pair of high I know these look so tiny right high-waisted black skinny jeans with rips just on the knees and they hit perfectly to my knees um, which I love it's kind of like the American apparel jeans um, but cheaper, which is surprising because these were expensive, but they have the nice designless pockets and these will go with anything because like you saw, I do wear a lot of cropped things and I think this will be great because high waisted and they're cropped. So yeah, it is just a bit more difficult for me to find perfect fitting jeans that are not the perfect length and the nice like width for my waist. And this place, I actually tried on their smallest size and that was that was too small for me. So I got, this is apparently waist 25, which is surprising because that is not my size. And I just love it so much. It's such great quality and they feel like leggings, just how comfortable they are. But they like are jeans, but they're so stretchy. So they're jeggings, but they're just perfectly made. And I love them. These next two purchases that I will show you are um, winter based just because I live in Canada and I need the perfect winter things because winter here is brutal. The first place I went or the next place I went was Aritzia and I got a winter jacket and this is um, the Golden by TNA and it's the Larson Parka Altitude Series and it's the their warmest parka. It's gray, waterproof, nice magnet closing pockets pockets inside straps it's got all the doodads it's got a nice fur or faux fur hood super deep so excited to wear this in the winter time and I love it so went to Hudson's Bay and got um, this pair of boots these are Sorel women's black fawn Tivoli high to tweed don't even know what that means but this is what they look like very 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 nice high for the snow that goes up waterproof good just for slipping around or so you don't slip around in the snow and ice and yeah I love these and they're so great and these are size six and a half girl I am size six when did I get such big feet? So that's what I got for clothing and then I'll just go into the last bits of non-clothing products. So I got two candles from Bath & Body Works. The first one I got is Lakeside Sunrise. It's a very pretty scent. It really is what you would smell if you're on a lake and there's a sunrise and I can't really describe it. It's musky but it's also very fresh and clean. Um, but I really do love this. They were having a two for 25 sale, so. Then the last um, one I got, when I open this, I will smell it like so full on, so. Oh, that smells good. Um, wow, that's very strong. It's very strong, but it's really, really nice. It's the pumpkin pecan waffles. Mmm, that smells so good. It really does smell amazing, so. It's like the waffle batter scent that you smell when like your mom's making breakfast downstairs and you smell the waffles but it's also the nuttiness in it that smells so good and then a hint of pumpkin oh my gosh that's just beautiful next place I went was indigo so I could get another book this is why not me by Mindy Kaling the second book that she's written and I read her first book and it was great and I finished it so now I'm reading this one and I am so excited to read it just because I love the first one and she's just hilarious and I love just reading her books. This one's a very, very short. It's like 200 pages. Um, the last one was maybe longer, but I'm okay with it as long as I can read her. It's awesome. Just so much. Last thing I picked up is this eyeliner from Sharper's Drug Mart. Maybelline Master Precise Eye Studio Ink Pen Eyeliner in Black because this is my favorite eyeliner. It works really nicely. Thank you, Alex, for showing me. Um, this eyeliner because it's so perfect and just 
So that was everything. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a big old juicy thumbs up and click the big old juicy subscribe button. And just make sure that you comment if you like the video and if you have any other requests for me to do, leave it in the comments down below. Thank you all so much for your nice comments that I've been seeing on my previous videos. I absolutely appreciate it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Ta-ta!